Sorry about that. I never did. But with the frost getting into a scarecrow's turnip head, damp rotten his boots and putting mold on his straw and such. But you keep still and all your pesky rubbish. Always a squidding and a scrabbling in my stomach. Ain't nesting time, you know. You ought to be on a Christmas card, you should. Yeah, with a, a sprig of holly and a couple of candles. Talking about Christmas. Can you hear what I hear? Rejoice, rejoice, O Christian men, O Christ our Lord is born again. Laid inside the stable far, nestling underneath the star. Christ is born. Me with woolly whiskers and call me Santa. That's a Christmas carol. Yeah, them some titchy humans. This is Christmas Eve, this is. Yeah. Wethel Wurzel spending the festive season. Stuck on the pole in the middle of a drafty field, catching his death of mildew. That's where he is, all right. But it's not where he's stopping. Come on, Robin Redbreast. You're nice and tight to let the festivities and joining this herself. Yeah. Where's our gummy? Stop! Even at Christmas time, you try the patience of the patron saint of scarecrows. What mischief are you up to this time? Sing loud, sing loud, all of mankind for Jesus. Now get out your hymn books and we'll try Hark the Herald Angels Sing. Come on. Wait. Never mind, Richard. Just come on. A scarecrow's rightful place, Wurzel, is in the middle of a field where his maker intended him. But it's Christmas, your generosity. Particularly at Christmas. You can't go gallivanting up at this time of year. I won't go gallivanting nowhere, Mr. Crowman, sir. I was just going for a walk. Hmm? I was going to ask Aunt Sally if she'd accompany me to the Scarecrow's Ball tomorrow night. And just as soon as I was asked her, I was going to be back on duty quicker than a squiffy ferry. Duty, Wurzel? I doubt you know the meaning of the word. This is Christmas Eve, the most important date in the Scarecrow calendar. And for once at least, you're going to stay put. Arms, outward, stretch! Hey, why for you tying me up, your effervescent? For your own good, Wurzel. The humans don't spend their Christmases all tied up in fields, it ain't fair. When will you learn? Human ways is not scarecrow ways. They has cups of tea and slices of cake, as humans. Yeah, and they has roast turkey and crispy pud with all the trimmings. 
And them little, them little titty humans, they gets their stockings all filled up with goodlies on Christmas morning. And who, may I ask, fills those stockings? Well, Santa Claus, of course, when he comes down the chimbleys. And after he's filled the stockings, how does he find his way to the North Pole? By using us scarecrows for his landmarks, your impressiveness. Everyone knows that. Yeah, we all point north on Christmas morning. Well, if it for us scarecrows, he <laughs> might finish up in New Zealand, mayn't he? And that's the reason, Wurzel, why you will not move one millimetre from this post. Or else. Or else what, Mr. Crowmancer? Or else you won't go to the Scarecrow Ball tomorrow. But all Scarecrows go to the Scarecrow's Ball. They look forward to it all seasons. Wurzel, Scarecrows only go to the Scarecrow Ball when they behaved all seasons, and you're sadly lacking in that department. Now, here you are, and here you'll stay. All day today, all night tonight. Happy Christmas, Wurzel. Happy Christmas, your illuminescence. I'm stuck here all alone, so I think I'll have a moan. Maybe sing a little ditty. You may think it's just self pity, but if this was your position, you would soon lose your derision. Cause there's something that ain't right. Oh, dash my hat, what's worse is that. Christmas isn't Christmas without Christmas in your heart. Christmas Eve doesn't wonder we if there isn't love to start. A merry time, holly berry time, isn't anywhere near here. And Christmas isn't Christmas, isn't Christmas, isn't Christmas this Isn't Christmas without Christmas is good cheer? Winterland isn't Wonderland if there isn't magic here. And Santa Claus hasn't got a cause when kids' laughter isn't near. And Christmas. Isn't Christmas, isn't Christmas, isn't Christmas this year? Wurzel! I think it's awful of the Croman to tie you up like this, Wurzel. You can come and spend Christmas with us if you're lonely. Who said anything about being lonely? Scarecrows is never lonely, especially if they've got a scarecrow's ball to go to. A scarecrow's ball? Can we come with you? Certainly not. Whoever had a titchy human has gone to a scarecrow's ball. I'm going off to see Aunt Sally. He didn't even thank us for untying him. Work on, work on, wait for us. I don't want to get a friend of what are you looking for, Wurzel? Aunt Sally, how many times do I have to tell you? You want to wash your ears out, you does. I shouldn't think Aunt Sally would be seen dead up here. Well, I ain't looking for her up here, you daft apron. I'm looking for an head to look for her in. Which head are you looking for, then? You'll see. Oh, don't mind it, don't mind it. Don't mind it. Don't mind it. Great, but Sherlock Holmes head. Is this what you've been looking for? Nah, <laughs> last time I wore that head, I was chased all over the countryside by a dirty great hound. Whoa, hey, here it is. Hey, me party going head. Oh, what do you need a party going head for? You'll see. Come over here. Come on. Now then, seeing as how it's Christmas, I'll let you change me head for me. All right? Take me out of then. Put your hands over my head. That's ready? One, two, three. 
full of straw. What do we expect? Let's put his other head on. Hey, how's that then? It's a great person. Yeah. Here's a good one. I said, here's a good one. Why is the letter got this out of a Christmas cracker, I did? Why is the letter T like an island? Because it's in the middle of water. Because it's in the... Well, you're not supposed to say that. Oh, all right. Why is the letter T like an island? <laughs> well, I don't know, do I? I haven't got my riddle and my re-head on. This is my party going out. Well, that's not going to help you find Aunt Sally, is it? Well, no, perhaps you're right. Well, maybe I won't wear this head, then. Maybe I won't wear one of the crow man's heads at all. Maybe I'll wear one of my own heads, one I made myself. Can you make heads, Wurzel? Oh, of course he can't. Only the Chroma makes heads. That's what you think. Here, wait a minute and I'll show you a Christmas head I made myself. It is. It's a Santa Claus head. No, it isn't. It's no master Dad it's about last Christmas. You wait till Aunt Sally sees this head. She knows an head when she says when Aunt Sally does, she'll invite me to a Christmas party up in the big house. Quick as pulling a Christmas cracker. You just wait and see. Yeah. Wazzle! Look, Aunt Sally doesn't live in the big house anymore. She got the sack yonks ago. Who cares? Let him find out for himself. Charades, we're going to play charades. Come on, Missy Hibbs. <laughs> you know, charades. Now, this takes me back to another Christmas Eve. Garrison surrounded, out of ammunition. Now, let's play charades, says the men's arm. Keep the regiment's pecker up. Bloody little woman, you know. <laughs> you know, all night long, she had the men. <laughs> <Stitching. laughs> are we going to play this game, Colonel Bloodstock, or are we studying military history? Message received and understood, sir. I will give you one. Try the man who came to dinner, sir. Don't let him get that one. Six words in the title. Uh, a play. A play in a film. Tickety boom, Mr. Peters. No speaking, Colonel. Mum's a word, my mum. Um, Second word. A vicar. Well, not a vicar. Uh, the Archbishop of Canterbury. <coughs> uh, the Pope. <laughs> Oh, very good, sir. Oh, oh, oh. Turn out. Who is the speaker? What is it, Atkins? There's a tramp at the front door wearing some sort of mask, sir. Oh, that's right enough, you know. I can't stand him. See him all. Very good. No, no, as you were, Atkins, after all, it is Christmas. Give the fellow a mince pie, wish him the compliments of the season, then see you all. Very good, sir. <laughs> now then, ha ha ha, where were I? Hold your hand now. Colonel says to give you this. Merry Christmas. And the same to you. Up it! <laughs> that dang gossiper! That old good. Tell me to up it, did he? I'll show him. Here, yeah, I'll be bummed through it if I don't get in the proper way. That's Santa Christmas. Here, yeah. it. The invasion of body snatchers. The Walking Dead. I, I was a teenage werewolf. <laughs> the Mummy. <laughs> the Charge of the Light Brigade. <laughs> Mr. Deeds goes to town. <laughs> Where's that? Ah. ah. This one looks all right. <laughs> Are you by any chance Mary Poppins, Colonel? I must say I'm not, madam. Aye. Yeah, this will give Aunt Sally a nice surprise. <laughs> uh, I think we can see defeat, Colonel. Uh, we give in. You surrender, do you? I thought I detected a sense of victory in me all sorts. <laughs> I am the fellow king to dinner! <laughs> Get it! 
fellow out of here. Wait a minute! 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 W